thing is that for over 200 years that there was no development on this side uh, no opposite to the cities like um, Dubai, Sharjah, Abu Dhabi where things were developed and uh, all buildings were um, replaced with a new one here for over 200 years we had just continuation of occupation without, without any changes of course there were changes as such but in 1970s when uh, Zabi tribe left the place they left Jazeera Hamma as it is almost untouched right now so as you can see this is the map from uh, 1820 uh, made by a um, British soldier uh, who was a member of an expedition here. He describes here Jazeera al Hamma as a town which has been des deserted for some years. Uh, and that was 1820. So if it was deserted at that point, it doesn't mean there was no one living there. People lived there, but it also means that the occupation of this site was was or started before uh, maybe hundred years or even more uh, so it is one of the thing uh, things that uh, makes that Jazeera um, Hamma so uh, special and the other thing is that in as you can see in 1977 this is the map uh, from muni muni municipality uh, we, we still have the island here island which at this point was deserted people left that place but we still had a lot of structure a lot of buildings there so those buildings are standing even now most of them and we are working here we are working in that area so it's approximately almost 500,000 square meters it seems to be well quite a lot but <laughs> Uh, as you can see on the next slide, we, for those eight years, managed to excavate uh, approximately 10% uh, of uh, sites, well, potential archaeological sites here, which makes more or less, uh, I calculated that, 5% of the whole area, 23,724 square meters. So it's, well, still a lot of work for us to do if we would like to excavate whole uh, island. On an island we've got four different types of uh, sites. We can um, divide them into the mosques, compounds, shops on a souk area and four so, so uh, what we are doing, we are just uh, uh, doing our reports uh, based on uh, the method which is called the single context method. Correct. So it means that uh, for every single layer which we have, not only layer, deposit, uh, cut, uh, right. structure, right. for everything, we just uh, put the, 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 the individual number. And this number is like our name. Yes, mm. uh, each of us has the name. He mentioned that you put in the matrix. Yes, this is the matrix. Ah. Yes, but this is the, the final oh, step. Oh, so uh, here, when you have a look, we have the registers. And uh, what do we have? We have we have uh, all, the all the foundation here. We have here uh, the, like two steps. We have the field of the court, which we usually deal with, uh, you know, with a pen and uh, our. Uh, uh, not so nice writing. <laughs> yes. So, but later we put everything into the computer. So, so I mean, everything is digital. Yes, yes. This is the, at the end everything. So, so what do we have? What is the, the most important? The most important is the context register. Mm. When we have the explanation of every single number, yes? So when you have here a number, you can find the number here, and then you will find the what type of the context it is, uh, the short description, and where it is, when we recorded, and who recorded.
Yes. Wow. So um, here we have uh, uh, here we have the trench register because uh, if you um, you would like to know where it was, you have mm. to know the location of the particle crystals. And now uh, the context is is like as I said the, the most important issue because later when we collect yes pottery yeah when we collect the the bones everything that we do we record according to the context number yeah the context number just collect everything and thanks to the context numbers we can uh, later create the story of all the designs so, so um, everything already gets connected to this particular number yes so this one is the short description but it's not the end because we have we have the <coughs> every single individual context context has the, the particular uh, sheet when we have the more details about this. Mm -hmm. Yes. So we have the description about the material, the type of the sound, what kind of I, I remember things. when I met you, you were actually doing a lot of note making. So you were writing nice. all this. More yeah. than digging. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, she was yeah. buried in the papers. I was like, what is she doing? <laughs> well I've been there. <laughs> because this is this is the point, yes? Uh, here, here is the, the graph when you can see the stratigraphy. Stratigraphy is gave us the dating, but not the absolute dating, only just the relative dating. We can say what was uh, first, what was later. Yeah. So uh, you can see that this is very small site. It's only 500 kilometers. Yeah. This and is the entire site. Though. This is the yes. entire site. Okay. And uh, we uh, have some natural layers here. Yes, that was before the, the 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 human just pop up at the site. Yes. Then we have the two phases with a lot of the Irish constructions. So we have the, the no not structures, but uh, they, they 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 make some very light um, shelters. So um, <coughs> most likely during this uh, phase, uh, they start to dig the huge pits on the uh, in this area uh, for the British water because here in Jazeera Alhambra we didn't have the drinking water we have only the British water for the you know, washing or whatever uh, the source of the drinking water was just uh, on the main line when you have these two towers over there yes wow. these towers is remains of the protection system defensing system which protect the island from the main line yeah so then we have uh, every other phase uh, included the last one which will be related with the Iraq Fine Arts Festival because they <laughs> came and they put the ground, yes, they the uh, yeah, yeah, set this part. Yes. Small <laughs> dots. What is this for the right path? <laughs> so here we have the Iraq Fine Arts Festival because before the festival they leveled the ground and they put some, some gravel to make it more solid, yes. Right. So we have all the history of the site from the natural layers up to the... Is it different layers? Yes, yeah, yes. Wow. Yeah, so how can you see the colors too? Yeah. Or not the Red Island because of the color of sand. Yeah. And uh, this is the first plan of Jazeera Al Hamra, which wow. you can see the, the, the shape of the island. Destroy all fortification. And from the British Navy command from Bombay, they were sent the order to destroy all the fortification. No way. And this no is why way. this all the towers here was destroyed. So this I've layer which you have yeah. here. So yes, this is evidence, right? Yeah. Is for the burning, burning blowing, blowing. Like the expo, uh, explosions and book, yes, and no towers.